Republicans in the Alabama House are backing off proposals to furlough state employees for two days and suspend longevity bonuses for a year. Both ideas were considered to help the general fund budget, but Speaker Mike Hubbard said on Thursday that those proposals are no longer needed since a change was made to a cigarette tax bill. The proposals drew criticisms from Democrats who say they are now pleased to see the ideas have been dropped. Representative John Knight of Montgomery says the state shouldn't balance the budget on the backs of state employees. The two proposals would have raised about $8 million. Hubbard says he too is pleased that those benefits will remain. Now, the proposed cigarette tax increase will raise that tax by 25 cents per pack and an amendment to the bill also reduces a wholesaler discount and that raises another six million dollars.